So Wayne, great news this morning. You've signed a new two-year deal with the club here till 2024. What's your initial thoughts on that and how pleased are you to be staying even longer? Yeah, Stevie, obviously delighted to, to extend my time at, uh, at Derbyshire. Um, yeah, I mean, this, this place is home for us and, uh, and for me, um, had a fantastic time here so far and, and really excited about extending, extending to, uh, to 2024. Um, I mean, we've, we've made great strides, um, particularly in this last year with Mickey. Um, and uh, and, and the, the focus and the goal is to, is to win, uh, win a trophy and win trophies. So I think uh, it, it really, really is uh, going to be an exciting next, next couple, of, uh, couple of seasons. Yeah, you talk about trophies there. Obviously, you experienced it in 2012 when promoted from Division 2, but it has been a while for Derbyshire. And I know that's something that you're really keen to, to take the club back to, but also you know, to even greater heights along with Mickey. Yeah, I think, I think um, it's been a long time. 2012 was a long time ago. Over, well, it's, it's sort of a decade now. And uh, I think for us um, as a group of players um, and as a club, it, it's really important that, that, uh, that we do bring some silverware um, back, to, back to Derby. So I think, yeah, from my perspective, um, it's a huge ambition um, to, to win a trophy over the next, uh, next few years. Um, and and um, uh, as we as we know, um, Mickey is a, a winner, and, and that's the focus and the, and the goal of, of this group of players and um, and, and the, the whole staff at, uh, at the club. Yeah, and you've developed a great relationship with the members and supporters as well. How much would it mean to you to, to bring more silverware to them and celebrate success with them? Yeah, I mean, uh, it, that, uh, it's it's a it's a pretty special relationship that I that I've got with uh, with the fans and the members and, and supporters. So. Um, it, it will be, uh, yeah, it'll be truly, truly special to be, to be able to repay the faith that, that everyone has had in me over the years and, um, and, and, and bring some silverware and some joy to, to the club. Yeah, and signing this new deal, it will mean that by the time this deal finishes, you'll be 40 years old. And <laughs> now some people may look at that and ask, how much longer has Wayne Madsen got? But when you look at last season, leading run, run scorer in the county championship, one of the leading batters in the Vitality Blast, Go for as long as you want, can't you? Um, yeah, I, I mean, <laughs> I don't think I can go for as long as I want, <laughs> but no, no, no. I think I, cert certainly um, while I'm playing well, enjoying my cricket, contributing to the team, and and um, and contributing in, in not just in in the in scoring runs, but um, with supporting and helping uh, develop our players. I think that for me, that mentoring role as a senior player is is, is really crucial. Supporting Lewis, um as, as captain. Um, but I think yeah, that, that role as a senior player, um, I don't know, it was, we'll, we'll, we'll see as long as the body, the body lasts, uh, we'll keep going as long as, uh, as long as possible. Yeah, and you, uh, with this deal, it'll take you beyond, beyond a decade and a half as well with the club. I mean, that, that's such a special journey you've had. You're now third on the club's all-time run scorers. That second place is, uh, is within your sights. It's a real opportunity to make history next year, isn't it? Yeah, I, there, there is, there is, and I think for me that's um, that's certainly something that that'll be that'll be a bonus and, and extra special. I think the the main focus is actually winning trophies um, and contributing towards that, uh, winning games of cricket. Um, the other the other things, if they come along the way, that's great. Um, but for me, I think the the biggest focus is is that silverware. Yeah, and we touched on on age. We touched on the fact you've had injuries in the past. You had a few run and repairs over the winter. You, you picked up an injury during last season. Incredibly went and scored a, a T20 century against Durham while still feeling the effects of that. You've undergone surgery. You are recovering. You will be missing the T20 competition in January. But you'll be ready for the new season, we understand. Yeah, um, obviously uh, it, it's, it's never nice to, to miss any, any sort of cricket um, at any time. Um, but I, I, I picked up a, a niggle in the middle of the year. I, I landed awkwardly on, on my shoulder, and um, it, it, was, it was okay then. Uh, it got worse towards the back end of the season. I, I think I landed on again in the second last game, and it made it worse. So I've had to have a rotator cuff repair in my shoulder. Um, and we did that successfully in, in, uh, in October, um, and the rehab's been going pretty well since. Um, but uh, yeah, the the the, uh, the focus is to be ready for the start of the season, and and uh, realistically, that that's what's going to happen.